Hey guys, what's going on? Honest and Jack and back in with another video, and I am sorry it has been a week. Um, man, I was hoping to get uh, this year off to a better start, but man, I wish I could go back and restart this year again. I went and did a trick again. Uh, I did a TO off from Mel's Cousin. happened since uh, I last and it kind of runs into the uh, the window here but it's uh, lots happened since the last time I checked in with you guys and I've been meaning to get the recruiting video out have not done that yet but we are uh, we are uh, approaching um, you know February's be here you know that signing day will be here before we know it so I'm gonna definitely get caught up in all that um, but last video I posted real quick that Jim Cheney uh, his new offensive coordinator at Tennessee, coming back after a 10-year absence, of course, he came in uh, with Lane Kiffin back in 2008, um, and he was here and then he left and uh, ended up at Georgia uh, last stop, and you know we we swiped him from Georgia, uh, you know, and I think I think definitely that was that was it was a good move on Pruitt's part, good hire for offensive coordinator, and. I definitely look forward to kind of seeing what Tennessee becomes now under uh, Jim Cheney as the new, again, offensive coordinator of Tennessee. And, of course, there were rumors going around of who else was going to be added to the staff. And T. Martin uh, was, you know, rumored. And we finally got that confirmation uh, this past week. You know, his job specifications have not been, uh, you know, finalized yet as of yesterday. Um but, uh, you know, his pr he was offensive coordinator, uh, wide receivers coach at uh, Southern Cal when his last stop. And so he'll probably continue to join the wide receivers, probably help Cheney with defensive back, stuff like that. Uh, so definitely uh, looking forward to seeing how that's going to work out. Of course, Kelly, uh, who was a safeties coach, we found out uh, yesterday as well, he'll be leaving for Alabama. And he's going to join, again, Nick Saban on his staff there. Uh, so... A lot's happening in the football world, of course, and I'm definitely looking forward to kind of seeing how uh, this uh, basically winter and spring turns out with recruiting, uh, spring practicing and stuff. Kind of see how uh, Tennessee staff shapes up. Right now, we got ten assistant coaches as of now, and of course, you know, I'm sure there's probably going to be one or two more changes as we head into the spring. So, I mean, I would just wouldn't surprise me at all. But of course, I definitely want to talk about recruiting. And stuff like that. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get to that. I promise. I will. Um, one of my viewers he asked me to do a recruiting video you know, like three weeks ago, two weeks ago, whatever it was, right before the holidays. And then, of course, holiday chaos happened and June 5th. And so I haven't done it yet. So I apologize. I'm sorry. Um, and I just I need to get back into the swing of things. Definitely been a little bit discouraged <laughs> the past two weeks. And so definitely want to get back on the right track. Um, and Tennessee basketball, of course, we've uh, we've been winning. Uh, it hasn't always looked pretty, uh, but uh, we beat Florida. Um, I, I did end up watching that game, uh, and I did not get to watch the Arkansas or Alabama games. Just I've been out of it, guys. I, I really apologize. But uh, you know, from the highlights and stuff that I watched from the Arkansas game, it looked like we had that game pretty well in hand. Um, slacked off. And uh, Coach Barnes said basically we got outplayed in the second half. I don't know. Uh, it looked like they uh, they gave they gave up a little bit, so to speak, or not. I I wouldn't say Tennessee gave up, but they kind of just slacked off a little bit. You know, we had the lead. Well, you know, I was getting updates on my phone, of course, from the game. And then, of course, we squeaked by against Alabama uh, yesterday with a uh, 71-68 win. And, you know, things are going pretty good so far for Tennessee in the basketball season. You know, we're one in the SEC. We're still three in the nation. 16-1 uh, and one is our overall record. Um, we're on a 12-game winning streak, and we're 5-0 and in the SEC. So, can't really complain with how things are going um, right now for basketball. We're winning 
a win is a win in my opinion it might come down to the wire and you know these sec games are definitely tough you know they're all tough especially when you see a lot of these guys twice you know at home and away and atmosphere is always definitely definitely um a factor and so i think that uh you know definitely being home helps um i think being away in a hostile environment can be tough but tennessee has shown that uh, they can do it for the three, basically three away games that we've had so far. Um, but, you know, I'm definitely looking forward to seeing how the, the, the team progresses as we get into February and March and we get those Kentuckys and stuff like that. You know, those, uh, that, that basically, that, the Kentucky is the, the main opponent. You know, of course, we swept them last year. Definitely would love to see that again uh, this year. And, um, Man, you know, basketball season has, has been good. Just I wish I could have been uh, watching more the past uh, week and a half or so. I just haven't been able to. Um, but, yeah, guys, I just want to put out a quick update. Let you guys know that I'm alive. I haven't gone anywhere. Um, honestly, I've been, I've been playing a lot of Skyrim, and I've been playing a lot of Minecraft because I just I haven't. Yeah, I, that's all I've been doing. And laying on the couch or whatnot. And, you know, that's been drinking coffee. <laughs> but anyway, <coughs> guys, I, uh, I appreciate you guys. <clears throat> excuse me. Appreciate you guys watching, sticking with me uh, as, as, I, as, I, as I battle whatever this is right now. But uh, anyway, I, I appreciate you guys a lot. Leave a comment. Um, and I will start cranking out videos hopefully this week for you guys. Anyway, I appreciate you guys. We'll talk to you guys later. Honestly, signing off. We'll see you.